guys, this is try number three on this video. I've had students pop on and ask questions. I'm currently, I uh, have to be signed into my Google Meet here. So if they pop on, I have to answer them. Um, I just opened up my box of rootstock for the year. Um, I ordered kind of what they had left over, I guess, and I ended up with some 316s and um, 3 eighths. So I got two varying sizes, so some big stuff down there, little stuff here, um, and then I have a bunch of stuff that either didn't take last year or um, I didn't get to graft um, last year out in the in the planter to, to graft to too. So I think there's 70, 80, 80 something, 84 rootstock total here. Um, I got my scion in here. I got the bucket to put the water in. I got a grafting knife there. My block of pruner here and stuff to label with there. And I'm about ready to start. So I just wanted to let you guys know it's April, Tuesday, April 7th. So that's when I'm going to start this year. Hope everyone's doing well. Hey guys, just down here in the, the grafting den. I'm going to try something new today. I bought an engraver. Uh, been, I've had this for like a year and haven't done anything with it. I finally got some tags that I'm gonna engrave. Um, my wife came with me to the orchard a couple weekends ago and took pictures of all the tags that I had. Um, and I'm gonna try to get that same information that I have on those tags onto these bad boys. Sorry. Um, so yeah. I'll keep you posted and let you know how it goes. This could be interesting. Hopefully I have my fingers when we come back. And there is the finished product. I did not leave enough room. I'm gonna pop a hole down here on the bottom and one up top. I kind of forgot I was gonna put one down here while I was doing it, but that turned out really sweet. Engraved right in there. I don't know how long these will last or anything, but gotta be better than just writing into like the pop pop can or aluminum or whatever or the I guess I used uh, some sticks that you'd just write with pencil on but these are pretty sweet obviously I started off going a little too deep so I adjusted it and it got better as I want and I'm not very neat anyway so it turned out awesome I'm happy with them just wanted to show you what a couple of finished products look like uh, like ones I grafted all right when I grafted them when I planted them Same with that one. I got those these were one of my first trees. So got that one from Burnt Ridge Planted it spring of 13. Yeah, the poles top bottom. I'll do wire. I do the welded wire cages So I'll do a wire to the top and to the bottom so they aren't flapping around in the, the wind Yeah, looks pretty sweet Happy with my purchase. I got these from Etsy from some gal. I think they are supposed to be for like some kind of stamps or something, but just aluminum. Hopefully they they last. We'll find out. 